Welcome to the Tuesday edition of Spotting Tampa International. Hey, sit back, relax. Let's get right into the aviation action. Spirit! That's 2.03. Headed to Houston this morning. American taxiing for one left. Boy, this uh, east northeast is wind this morning. It's actually comfortable. Oh my gosh, does it feel great here this morning? 1224, that's Delta. 8321 blast off machine now on its way to Detroit. Motown, the Motor City, the Jackson 5 Special. Gates runway one left, back to the Victor 4 with you. We got a Delta taxi for one left. What happened to 1189 from America? They were cleared, it seemed like five minutes ago. Come on out. Where are you hiding? Are they just taking their time this morning? Not fully awake. I think I hear them. There's 1179. Spare in the sky. Oh, great, Bob. 3330. Coming down to see us here on one right. They're headed to BWI this morning. Baltimore's Washington International. Light it up. Just landed on the left side. Thirteen fifty-two, Tampa Tower. The wind is zero eight zero five. Only one left. Clear to land. One left. Clear to land. American twenty twenty. Runway one left. Back to the American two with.
Who's hiding that's behind that's a tree? That's Southwest coming down to see us. That's Raymond James Stadium in the background, home of the Tampa Bay Super Bowl champions. Buccaneers. Oh, it's exec jet time. Surprised he turned on his lights. He's facing uh, the southwest now, gonna blast him. Yikes. Winds are now 090 at five. I'm on top of the uh, economy parking garage, so the winds are blowing a little higher up there at you know, 50, 75 feet higher than ground level. Twenty-two cleared to St. Louis. Boy, it looks like we might have a gorgeous sunrise this morning. Twenty twenty on its way to Charlotte. CLT. Hour and twenty minutes this morning. Looking back at the long turn parking garage. American 2020, contact departure, good morning. American 2020. Rocky Mountain High, Colorado. Southwest 25. Headed to the Mile High City, Denver.
Hey, it looks like another spirit pushing. It's a yellow submarine kind of morning. Absolutely gorgeous out. Breaking news, TSA passenger counts. Sunday, July 11th. New passenger record. 2 million, 198, just, just a tick short of 2.2 million. Friendly skies are getting busier and busier. At distance spec on the downwind leg here to Tampa International's FedEx. 1410, MD11, oh yeah. Yeah, breaking news, The uh, and this is thanks to great viewers, that DC-10 has officially been retired from FedEx. Done, finished, nothing but the MD-11 now. Anybody on Airport Road is going to get one hell of a show here in a couple of seconds. Oh, planes, trains, automobiles. Does it get any better? Wings hanging over onto the street. Nineteen fifty nine. Thirty two years old. Boy, I wish I was thirty two. It's an oldie but a goodie A three hundred from Indianapolis. Thank you. 
Don Heavy, any right turn, check to the ramp via Whiskey, Juliet, hold short of Charlie. Any right turn, Whiskey, Juliet, hold short of Charlie, check 1559. That looks like 737-8 MAX. Check that out while you're um, taxing him out. We got a stray dog on the runway? Which it's our coyote. Yeah, there's a stray dog somewhere over by uh, Delta and uh, runway 28 over there. Oh, look at there's a Transavia jet in the background. What was the reason for the report? Five thirty five's cleared. The stray dog is on runway ten two eight, about a thousand yards. 1,000 feet east of where it intersects with uh, one right. Sounds like American actually aborted. They had a window, I guess, in the cockpit pop open, and they weren't sure where that dog was, so they didn't go. Airport 7 Company. Airport 7 I haven't seen the dog yet. I wish I could. I'm almost betting it's our coyote. I haven't heard anything about the coyote in several months. Um, aircraft, uh, 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 Aha! They're calling it the Coyote. Meep meep. United's finally waking up. Well, everybody's after the coyote now. 781, our max finally getting the go. somewhere over there. Airport 
Well, he's on the runway now. I haven't seen him yet. He just canceled takeoff for Southwest. So he's somewhere over here. Somewhere on the runway. Well, he's over there. That's Transavia down there lined up on 2-8. And I just heard the Coyote is now just past a 3,000 foot to go marker on uh, one right. So he's holding everybody up. One left or one right? Uh, Airport 7's cleared to go on the runway now. They gotta get rid of this guy. Down here someplace. Maybe you can see him. There he is! He's running! He's running! Just off the right side of the runway. Boy, he's moving. Boy, he just does not want to leave the side of that. Uh... Oh, he's, he's coming back on the runway. He's going to go across the runway. Oh, my gosh. Oh, they're right up there with him. Not sure where he went. <laughs> After all that, United's still not ready. This is 2693. Transavia lined up on 10 2 is going to take off. Coyote, that little rascal sure made a mess of things. Ooh, a little condensation action. Twenty-three ninety-three gets to go. Is can make the shortcut through Charlie Two, back taxi, and then blast out of uh, one right. Wait a minute. South United Seven Three's never blast out of any place. Wow! United then Southwest. The other United sitting down there on the right. Yeah, no, I don't think you can see it. Oh, the coyote messed up everybody. Reminded me of the old 727s. Lift the front wheel and keep the back wheels on the ground. I think it's going to be a couple minutes. So I got a couple of several to wait. Very patient. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Coyote. Well, we got into 4,000. New clearance. Boeing experimental cleared runway two eight. It's 
been over at Airborne where they convert a lot of aircraft to cargo. Oh, this is awesome. This is rare. Two-way takeoff. The coyote. <laughs> beep beep. Ah, uh, 1541. 757 rocket ship. How sexy is that? There's those birds they're talking about. They're chasing the 75 down the runway. Oh, we know this guy. I believe that's 635. We know it's headed to Seattle. Almost six hour flight this morning. 2,520 miles to Seattle. I think I saw the puffin pushing back from Frontier. Hey, speaking of Frontier, there's Miracle, our seagull buddy. I think that's Elray, the elk, one of our horny buddies. Yeah, check out the rack on this guy. Oh yeah, looking good. Delta's 1222, the paparazzi special. TPA to LAX, Los Angeles, California. First class is packed, jammed, always full. Movie stars, game show hosts, wrestlers, YouTubers, wannabes, haters, used car salesmen. We're headed off to Los Angeles. Let me shopping. Rodeo Drive by... Oh, into the wall is shame. Oh, that's my train of thought even. Shopping at Rodeo Drive. Then up to Beverly Hills? No, not Beverly Hills. Up to Malibu for lunch. Back to the Beverly Palms Hotel for a little light dinner. Cocktails. And maybe a little dancing. Oh, yeah, if you listen carefully, you can hear the corks already popping in the champagne first class. Thirty-eight twenty-seven. Hey, that's Amazon Air. Two hours and thirty-eight minutes from SJU, San Juan, Puerto Rico. Seven six seven. Well, we've had an A three hundred heavy, two MD elevens, but now it's seven six. Ooh, 
very nice touchdown. Barely a poof of smoke. Turn and you can catch it with me this way, but say have a good one. 21-16. 1,011 miles to LGA LaGuardia. LaGuardia is not my favorite airport, but I'll tell you, flying in and out, spectacular views. Only one right, cross to eight. Cross to eight, to eight, the whole shore of Sierra, please. I hear heavy? Heavy on final? Well, that's a wrap. That's going to conclude this edition of Spotting Tampa International. Hey, thanks for being on board today. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Hope you enjoyed the journey. You can smash that subscribe button, like, share, and hit the notification bell as I upload daily. And as always, we'll see you again tomorrow in another edition of Spotting Tampa International and maybe a surprise airport or two. See ya.